A new law goes into effect tomorrow that will help some children and their parents breathe easier. The law allows children to take asthma controlling nebulizers to after school functions and to sporting fields. CBS 2's uh, Carolyn Gustav has this story. New tonight at 6. Seven year old Harrison Selnick knows when he needs help fast. You cough a whole lot and you cannot. And it's very, very hard to breathe. Doctors here at Strauss Allergy and Asthma taught him what to do. Medicine opens up his airways, delivered right to his lungs from the mist of a nebulizer. The portable machine saves lives, and yet he's not allowed to bring one where he may need it most on school soccer fields. It puts in um, special medicine for you that helps you breathe. That now changes. A new law in New York State allows children with asthma to bring their own nebulizer to school and athletic fields and administer it themselves. It took years of lobbying by Dr. Harvey Miller, a specialist who's seen tragedy on fields, waiting for an ambulance, nebulizers locked away behind closed school doors. They're allowed to use it and they can carry their nebulizer on the athletic field. I think this is what they so call what is so called no brainer. Senator Phil Boyle sponsored the legislation akin to having life saving defibrillators on school fields. This is the next step, and I believe it's more likely that a child would have an asthma attack uh, than a, a cardiac arrest. Next up, legislation to allow schools to buy their own nebulizer, so one's always on hand. Requiring nebulizers in school is met with resistance because of liability concerns and cost. You can buy a nebulizer for anywhere from $60 to $150. You can actually, in my opinion, finance that with a bake sale. Not a big investment in saving a life, says Dr. Miller, who thinks everyone will breathe easier if every school has one of these. In Islip, Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News.